Hey everybody, hi and welcome, and thank you for taking some of your time out of your day to spend it with me and my furry sidekicks here. Wyatt is hiding behind me, Zena's working on a busy bone, it is Friday, which means you guys are going to see this video tomorrow, the weekend, and I'm so excited because my long anticipated trunk club is here. Very excited. So, I was supposed to get a trunk probably a couple weeks ago, and my styles put it together. I got it for preview. I took some items out, probably half of them, and then I think she went on vacation. And the person who was stepping in for her added pieces that just weren't me. So she must have been checking my notes on vacation because I said, like, I don't, if it's not too late, I don't want these pieces. Don't bother sending them. It would just be, a, you know, I don't want it, your team to go through the trouble of, of packaging them and UPS to ship them to me because they're just, they're just not me. I don't want them. So she was able to catch it and stop it, but you have to wait for it to come back and then start the whole process over again, which is what happened. And here is my box. So I'm excited about it. And I think that my this was not my normal stylist. I think she was still on vacation. At least I hope it's just a vacation because I really liked Emily, who was my normal stylist. Um, she always did a really great job. She was really getting to know me well. I can't remember who my the stylist was that did this one, though. Um, but Trunk Club is through Nordstrom. Great variety of products. Uh, anything that pretty much uh, Nordstrom sells from accessories and bags and jewelry and formal wear and um, intimates. Anything that you could possibly want, they pretty much can include it in your trunk. And you get to up to 10 items. You do get to preview them. You can take pieces out and ask your stylist to replace them, but you don't get to uh, add comments after that. They'll add items. You still get to see them because you can see that through the browser or through the app on your phone. Um, so you still can see what's been added to your to your trunk, uh, but you don't get to add feedback or take any items out after that first time. Free shipping both ways. If you use your Nordstrom card, no styling fee. Otherwise, I think it is $25. So fun. I do it monthly, but I do think that you can determine how often you want to do it. All right, let's do this. Here is what the inside of my box looks like. Everything comes in packaging. I do see a pair of shoes in here color, pattern. Yeah, lots of color and pattern. And what's also nice is that your stylist will put um, all kinds of outfit ideas together for you, not just with the items in this box, but also with items in, that you've kept from previous trunks. How fun is that? So let me get everything out of the box and I will be out of the bag and the box. I will be right back. Okay, everything is out of the box and out of the bags. And you do get a little folder inside your box that has the return label for anything you don't love and don't want to keep. Little stickers to seal the box shut again. You send it back to UPS so you can drop it off location, have it scheduled to be picked up at your home, whatever's easiest for you. And you also get a little note from your stylist and pricing sheet of all the items that you've received. And you can set pricing limits. My stylist has been awesome lately. I used to get these really expensive pieces which are way too tempting, and I really asked not to send them to me. Um, so lately, she's been doing really good, so I'll be curious to see what's happening. So I just tried to block Zena from going behind the couch that I sit on here because she always tries to leave and hide back there, and she just pushed away what I used to block her, and she's back in the corner again. She's just smarter than I am, I guess. All right, let's get through these items. Oh, that dog. Anything to escape doing any work whatsoever. She only wants to supervise. So first up is an item from BP, and this is a little camisole. This is floral, very pretty. I like the pinks, greens, black, lots of color. This does have an adjustable strap, which I also love and usually need in order for these things to even come have a chance for them to fit me. So that's cute. It has a little scalloped edge here. Cute. That's first. Next, Vigos, and these look like jean shorts. What do you guys think of black jean shorts? 
I don't know. I don't think I own any black jean shorts. I think I own black dressy shorts, but I don't think I've ever bought a pair of black cut off jean shorts. So this will be new for me. For some reason, they just never speak to me in the summer, the dark black jean short. So these are the Luxe Stretch, stretch by, as I said, by Vigos. And I don't know, they're nice and long, so you could probably roll them or cuff them or wear them as they are. I'll be fun to try them. Next, what is this? I think it's a jumpsuit. Trunk Club also has a version of the style game that Stitch Fix has where you can give your stylist ideas of what you like or don't like by giving a thumbs up or thumbs down. So um, that is kind of nice. I think I might have said I liked this because I do love uh, jumpsuits. I think they're so nice and cozy, especially since we've been home for so long. I love these type of pieces when I'm in a hurry and just want to get dressed quickly. I love a one-piecer. Um, so when it was cooler and I dresses weren't really warm enough for me. This was a perfect piece, um, and it still is. This is really nice. So it has the, the stitching here, or is it a snap? Nope, it's a snap here to hold this closed. Little drawstring waist pockets, and it does look like it's full length, and it's black. It's cute. This is by Chelsea 28 Very cute. So I think I, I did see this in that game and gave it a thumbs up. Shorts, this is our pair of shorts next by Caslon. These are cute, little linen elastic waist pull on. I like the color, it's just like a salmon, very pretty, little pockets in the back. I like that they're regular patch pockets and not the best on pockets I hate when they like curl up at your bum, so those are nice. All right, another bottom, who are these by, NSF? And, oh, these are a jogger with a little cargo pocket. Check those out. These are silky, like a tensile. What do you guys think of those? Very different. And a different kind of green than I have on, so not really olive, but more like maybe a hunter type green. They call it moss. So moss, and I would call this olive. Very pretty. A jacket. <clears throat> this one's by BB Dakota. I'm laughing and choking myself. This is a faux suede um, pretty color, has pockets, little fold front. This is cute. Yep, I like it. It's probably a style I probably own. I don't know if I have it in tan, but I do like this. It's cute. What is this? This is a top by Reformation Reformation Jeans with a very square neck. What do you guys think of that? And it's got the striping in it. It's cute. It's silky. It has a silky feel to it. That's cute. All right, and now I think this is a dress by All in favor with this fun little snake print. That's cute. So this does have a little snap here and a faux wrap, I think. Oh no, I guess it is an actual wrap. There you go. Um, it is lined. Very pretty. Let's see what that looks like on. It looks a little short. We'll see what it looks like when I get it on. Very cute. It has almost like a little a little fold over sleeve here. There we go. Yeah, folds over. That's cute. Fun snake print. All right, and the last clothing item is by Caslon, and oh, this looks like a t-shirt dress. Very comfy. Has the buttons here at the top. Also has a fold up sleeve in a light gray. Very, very, very cozy. And the last item is a pair of shoes by Mark Fisher. And these are a really nice minimalistic style here. So the very thin little strap, nice little, maybe what, two, in it, two inch, maybe one and a half inch heel, um, thin little straps. I think this probably goes right around your ankle here, would be my guess, yeah. 
So very cute. I like the color. I love the neutral. It makes your legs look long when the color blends. Um, so very nice. And that's everything. So let's see what my stylist has to say. And her name is La Paris. Hi, Laura. I had so much fun adding items to this trunk and love the helpful feedback you provided. We love challenging you to step out of your comfort zone a bit and try things you might not have chosen on your own. We do hope you'll trust us on these pieces and give them a try. Please check out the outfits we put together for added inspiration. Please don't forget to fill out the feedback form before returning your trunk. Um, they can process exchanges and let us know if you have any questions. Best, La Paris. All right. I think this wasn't bad, so I'm excited to see what they look like on. Let's do it. So I have the first outfit on, and I put on the cami with these really fun joggers and the sandals. So they're the only shoes I have, so I'll probably wear them throughout the video. Starting with the sandals, I really like them. They have thin straps, so I think I'd have to wear them around to make sure they don't hurt my feet, especially the small strap going right across my toes. That's the one I'm mostly worried about, but I think I'd have to wear them. They do go around my ankle, which you'll see when I try on the shorts a little bit better, but... Um, I like them. I like the length of them. I love the way they look and I just am concerned with the straps being so tiny they might hurt after a prolonged wear. So I'm going to wear them around the house and see what I think because I do like the way they look. So working my way up, these joggers. How fun are these? So I love that they put the pockets, these cargo pockets, down low and not here at your hip, like the biggest part of your hip. So that's kind of nice. Um, they have this very nice relaxed feel, like I just feel cozy in them. They feel nice on. They're the drawstring waist, so that's really nice. I could probably tighten them up a little bit. Uh, but they, I have room, and they're just a really nice fit. I like them. I don't have anything that has like this kind of a baggy cargo uh, pocket feel on them, and let me know what you guys think of that look. I almost feel like I would like them better without that pocket, but um, I probably own something that without the pocket, a normal jogger like that. So this is a different style, and that's what you know make, would make me want to keep them. They're not like a normal jogger. I do have to tighten these, though, because I realize I'm pulling them up because I did not tighten them enough. There we go. They do have like a fake uh, zip here, but if that's not it. You just pull these right on. So overall, I think they're cute. I like them. Okay, and this little cami, which I didn't get a strapless bra, but I think you would need uh, if you're going to wear this, is very cute. It has a little bit of static cling going on with it, but it's a cute, colorful tank that would go with a lot. I think I'll try it on with maybe the black jeans as well and see what the, with the black jean shorts because I think it's cute. You get a little bit closer. You guys can see the pattern in this. It's very pretty. It has the little scalloped, which is not really noticeable, but the scalloped edging going here around the front of it. All right, I'll move on to the next outfit. So now I have on the black jean shorts, and shockingly, I don't dislike them the way I thought I was going to, and maybe it's because I'm just starting to get a little bit of color on my legs thanks to the fun and awesome weather that we had over the Memorial Day weekend. Um, so I actually, I actually like them. I'm shocked. I really thought I was going to hate them. Um, these fit really well. They are a mid-rise. They have room in them. So I have, I do have room here. You can see they're nice. The length is nice, but you could always, you know, cuff them and make them shorter if you wanted. So you could alter the length of these quite nicely if you so chose, but I actually don't mind them being the length that they are, but I feel like I would have options with these and yeah, I'm kind of surprised. I really expected to hate these. So let me know what you guys think. Do you guys have a lot of black, do you have black jeans in your wardrobe for the summer? And I think I would probably want to wear it with a brighter top um, to really, you know, still look summery or do a black and white thing um, and make sure it's still look summery. And I also like it with a neutral shoe, so I could never wear a black shoe with this. I would feel like it'd be way too dark, but the neutral shoe works. So I'll get a little bit closer so you guys can see these. 
Yeah, I'm kind of liking them. So surprised. These were a nice pick. All right, let's do another one. So now I have on the jumpsuit by Chelsea 28, Chelsea 28. And I really like this. Super comfortable, has a little snap here in the front, elastic waist with the drawstring pockets, perfect length. Look at this. And um, just an awesome fitting jumpsuit. I love it. So cute. What do you guys think of this? And I would, I want to keep this. If I hadn't kept one from Wantable, but this one actually fits me better. The one from Wantable is a little bit longer. It has like the fluttery sleeves, but it's black. And I feel like I don't need two of them, but this one actually is a little bit of a better fit, I think. Very cute. We'll just see what the price is, um, but I probably don't need two black short sleeve jumpsuits. But this is nice. Very nice. And this would be great. You could wear this to work, throw a blazer on, go to work. Perfect. Wear this at home for lounging, put tennis shoes on, put flip flops on, wear this over a bathing suit for vacation when it cools down. I mean, it's that versatile and that cozy. You really could get away with anything. And because it's black, you can get away with wearing it to work as well with a blazer. Super versatile. I like it. All right, we'll keep moving. So now I have on this very, very squared off neck top, which I didn't think I would love, but it's actually very pretty. You do have to wear a strapless bra with it because it comes all the way almost over to your armpit here and then crosses, goes up. And then these pull on shorts and these are really cute. So I love the little pockets. Again, drawstring waist. They remind me of the little pull on linen shorts that I got in my Amazon Prime wardrobe yesterday. Just nice and easy shorts. They have pockets in the back. Uh, great, sh great shorts for in the summer, right? When you just want to throw together a quick outfit that still looks cute. Um, so I think this actually makes for a nice outfit. These nice little easy wear sandals and so far comfortable. I'm really liking them. And I usually don't like anything around my ankle when I'm wearing shorts or dresses because I feel like it cuts me off. But since this one's thin, I think it's okay. So let me know what you guys think about that. And I just think these shorts just make for a nice look. I like the color of them and the salmon-y color. And this top is very different. I kind of like it. Let me know what you guys think. I'll get a little bit closer. You see the pockets come out just a little bit when I walk, but I think they are, you know, going down as I move. So hopefully they will be okay. I think it's pretty normal whenever you have any type of a side pocket. I still like them. I think they're cute. I did a little front tuck, but this top is um, not a bad length at all. So that's where it goes to if it's left out. It has some stretch to it and the ribbing. And um, yeah, overall, it's really cute. I'm going to try this jacket on with this. So you guys can see what this looks like by, this was BB Dakota. So this is a faux suede feel, has a little bit of a drop front, drapey front, and hangs a little bit lower in the front, but not dramatically. Nice little oatmeal color. Actually, it finishes this outfit off quite nicely. Um, so if you had a cooler evening, this would be really pretty on top of it. Very cute. I think these, there's some nice picks in here. What will I do? Here's what it looks like close up so you can see this suede feel. Then it does have the pockets. Very cute. All right, I have two more outfits to share. So now I have on the Caslon dress. This is a very soft, easy wear dress. Pull it over your head, you're ready to go. Put on flip flops, put on tennis shoes, put on heels. You really could wear anything. It has these fun little buttons here on the side. I had this necklace on today, so I'm leaving it because you could dress this up or go casual, but I like the little buttons. The neckline is not as high as I was thinking it could be. 
It has room, so it's not snug in any way. So it is basically a t-shirt dress. And um, the length is good. It comes to right at my knee. A great stay in dress, right? Stay at home, a nice Sunday comfy dress. I really like it. This is a fun dress. I wish it was a brighter color for summer. That's probably the only thing I don't like about it is I just wish it was a color. Pink, <laughs> blue, but I like it. And I think you could really dress it up. All right, let's get to the last dress. Okay, so I have the final item on, which is this true wrap dress. So it ties over here on this side, it ties on this side, um, and it does, you know, come almost all the way over. Not sure if the wind blew, if I would have an issue or not. So I might want to wear something underneath it. It has a snap here, and it has the sheer sleeves. So it's all fully lined with the exception of the sleeves. I think it's cute. I like the print. I think it might be a little bit short, so I would never wear this to work. This would be more of a date night dress, but I think it's a cute, a cute one. Here's a closer up look. Let me know what you guys think of this one. It almost has a dolman type sleeve to it um, for the overlayer, and then the underside is more form fitting with the uh, lining. I think it's cute. And that's everything. So let's talk pricing. And I hope my stylist did well. She did. So as I look at these um, pricing, nothing is over $100, not one item. All right. So first up is the floral wrap front mini dress. And that is this one, all in favor. This is only $29.40. So now what do you think? Now for $29.40, <laughs> um, I kind of like it. Yeah, I'll have to think about it, but it's, yeah, for under $30, this is a really pretty dress. Let me know what you guys think. I'm surprised. It's very cute. Next up is the suede it out drape front faux suede jacket by BB Dakota. Guess how much this is? to help feed my jacket addiction. Guess how much this is? It is under $40. $35.60. How awesome is that? Amazing. Next, the Ivet Cargo Joggers by NSF. So these are expensive. And when, if I remember looking at these, these were originally over $200. I want to say $225, something like that. These were on sale. In fact, is the price? Yeah, $225. So that's the price tag on here. These are on sale for $90. So if I did want to keep these, now's the time to get them because they're more than half off. Um, I have to think about that. I did actually really like them. You guys tell me. Or do you think they'd be worth the $90? Did they look good on? What did you think? I have to think about that one. The Faux Wrap Jumpsuit by Chelsea 28 is $88. So this one was not on sale, but I had told them that I liked it, so I think that's why they sent it. But $88 is the original price. Very cute. I'm thinking I, I should not be keeping it because I did keep that one from Wantable. The Scallop Satin Camisole. All right, that's this one. $12.50. How awesome is this trunk? <laughs> I'm so used to getting expensive items. I can't believe how cheap these pieces are. $12.50. And the colors go so well with these joggers. If I kept the joggers, I might keep the cami, but I'm not sure. Next, the Linen Shorts by, Ka by Kazlan. That is these, right? So these pretty ones, these are $49. I liked these. Do I like them for $50 after these other prices? I'm not so sure, but I did really like them. Then we have the Button Detail T-shirt dress, also by Kazlan, $59. That's this one. What did you guys think of this? It was so comfy on. I don't know if it, like, did anything for my overall style, but I thought it was super comfy and an easy wear dress. The Bardot top by Reformation. That's this one. What did you guys think of this super squared off top? So that's $48. I kind of liked it. I don't know anything like that. So squared off. I kind of liked it. Then we have these sandals by Mark Fisher. These are the Jared Ankle Strap Sandal, $89.98. I'm really liking these. I'm going to continue to wear them and see how they feel. I love the height of the heel 
I think so far they've been comfortable. I kind of want to keep these, but I'm going to try them out. And last is the Vigos Ace Denim Shorts. <laughs> okay. So these are only $22.98. So if I did want to add a pair of black jean shorts to my closet, this is the time for me to do it. Awesome pricing by my stylist. She did a great job. Great job. So what should I keep? Help me decide. If I had to pick very quickly, I'm leaning towards trying out the shorts. I'm thinking about the joggers, kind of like the top because it's different. I like the shorts and I'm thinking about this dress. I have to think about it. I might have to sit down, see, um, have some, go outside and see if the wind blows on my skirt here. And this jacket for $35 isn't bad, but I have to make sure I don't have anything similar in my closet. I will list all these items down below in case you want to check any of them out or add, request any of them from your stylist. And I will put my link to Trunk Club down below because I'm pretty sure if you use my link, you get $50 towards your next box and I get $50 towards my next box. So I will put that information down below for you as well. I always forget to mention that I do go back after I decide what I'm keeping and what I'm returning and mark that beside each of the items so that you guys know. Thanks so much for spending time with me today. I so appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed um, spending time with me as well. I love sharing my unboxings with you guys because the sidekicks don't offer me anything. Nothing. And Zena's still hiding in the corner. <sighs> so please stay healthy. Please stay well. I hope you guys are doing well. Um, I actually just heard today that my county is turning to green um, on a week from today by next Friday, which means that my hairdresser can open, <laughs> but I haven't heard from him yet. So I actually heard from my nail tech. So I actually have a nail appointment next Friday, which is going to feel so foreign, um, but I've not heard from my hairdresser yet. So hopefully I hear from him soon and I can get a haircut, which would be awesome. I hope you guys are all doing well. I hope you get to hear from whoever you're hoping to hear from once your um, states and counties and local governments are starting to open things back up again. But please remember to stay safe and healthy and do only do what makes you feel comfortable. Sending lots of love, sending lots of prayers, and keeping everybody in mind as we navigate through this crazy time right now um, and that we all stay safe and healthy. Please comment down below. Would love to hear what you think about these pieces. Um, would love if you would show me some support. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. If you subscribe, thank you, thank you, thank you. I have the best subscribers and supporters. Thank you guys. Until next time, have an amazing day. Bye.